All I'm gonna say is one plus one is definitely 11 doll face. <laughs> You pop your top and how you lose your cool and how you look at me too say why you no fighting no I can't stop it Hi my darlings and welcome back to a brand new vlog It is a this is supposed to be a spend a day with me but because I'm doing it a day prior because I want to do my hair with you guys I'm doing the overnight um a blowout type of thing so I wanted to do it with you guys, so I was like, what better way? Welcome back to a brand new video. I feel so much better. I was dying for four days, but funny enough, this flu made my skin. Chef's kiss. Chef's kiss. But um, yeah, let's get into this video. Also, I have a story time to tell you guys because I cannot believe, I cannot fathom what I'm going through or what I went through. Okay. <laughs> This vlog was actually supposed to start tomorrow, but I cannot keep this to myself. Also, I didn't want to tell you guys the story tomorrow. I was like, let me tell you guys today because I'm also doing my hair. So you guys remember that video um, where I was talking about modesty, circular music, and, 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 and. You guys remember that video? Okay, cool, shop. So I did that video for myself. Myself, me. Only Tarashe. I did that video talking about who? Talking about me. Again. Only Tarashe. Right? Tarashe with the GC, not a GX. I don't know why people feel the need to call me Only Tarashe with the GX. I don't understand. It's a GC. Minding my business, I did that video. I told you guys how I feel about modesty, how I feel about dressing up how i feel about cost um bikini pictures music and and, 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 and 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 so me doing that video i was in no way shape or form talking about a particular person talking about a particular somebody i was talking about myself just like i always do in every video if i have a problem with somebody mean guys i'm sorry more you i will say this once i'll say this twice i'll say it again uh in this world of god on god's green earth I'm not scared of a single person. If I want to say something, I'll say it with my chest. I'll never go around the corner. Let me tell you one thing about it, two things for sure. That's me. I, 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 I've I never been somebody who has been scared to go through the corners. If, if I'm gonna face you, I'm gonna face you. This girl, I come with receipts. I am bearing receipts because I wanted you guys to see this crazy thing. So this girl comes, um, she says, I go by the name of what Miss Luzugo. Um, Miss Luzugo is a, is a pseudo name. You know who I am. I said, Why on earth would I know who you are? Clearly, you know who I am. Why would I know who you are? You know, also for you to use a, a pseudo name, that means I clearly don't know you. So now she goes and explains. She goes and drags me. She says, I, she didn't have to do a BBL for people to know her. She didn't do all of these things for people to know her. You know, her journey with Christ was... You guys are going to see. I'm going to put it somewhere here. You guys are going to see. All right, guys. So, as I was saying, I'm not on Facebook. This person says, you went to my Facebook. I'm going to put the receipts as I said. You went to my Facebook. I knew you were talking about me when I saw circular music and bikinis. How important do you think that you are to be running in my mind the whole day for me to go on Facebook, search for you, whom at first, even now till to this day, I don't know who the hell you are. You are not that relevant in my life for me to go out of my way to look for you because I don't know you. So this person basically took the story of my salvation. Guys, you're gonna see, and then she said she was attacked by two Zimbabweans. She was saved by the circular music because you know she still posts circular music because God is telling her to still listen to circular music. God is telling her to still wear bikinis, by the way. And she will post those things. I never once in my video said people should not wear bikinis. I never once in my video said, I'm going to post the video. I'm going to put the video right here. I never once in my video said people should stop posting their pictures of bikinis. I never said people must stop listening to circular music. Every single video that I do, I always say me 
personally if you've been watching me and you're an og follower you know once i say me personally then you know that i don't want people to come and misquote me you know what i'm saying so this person took my testimony took my life and she projected it on herself okay she projected it on herself and then she said me that i'm talking about her who do you think you are in this life of christ on God's green earth, who do you think you are? My life is disrupting you so much that you're going to take everything that has happened to me and you're going to think I'm talking about you. Do you see where I'm going with this? Are you, are you, are you okay in your head, Miss Luzu? Because that's the name that you put, Luzu. Are you okay in your head to think that somebody's testimony is actually not a testimony? This person is talking about you. <laughs> like are you okay and then she goes and says she's going through something once she's done going through something she's gonna publicly address me <laughs> she's gonna publicly address me and she's gonna put me in my place and i mean i have no place to speak about salvation i i was shook I immediately blocked her because let me tell you, I do not have time for nonsense. I do not have time for nonsensical people who are actually insane. Because I think this girl is insane. Either she's obsessed with me or she's obsessed with my content. Because why would you watch someone's video and automatically think that person is talking about you? Because when you post circular music, God told you to listen to circular music. Because you post circular music and you post bikini pictures so that person has to be talking about you do you understand how crazy that is do you understand how freaking insane that sounds imagine me being obsessed with a person that i don't even know that i go to an extent of having facebook so i can come and have content for my christian people that is insane i think it goes back to say that People can say, yeah, why are you not posting your location? You are not that important. Well, we are. We kind of, we, we are. All of us are. You don't have to be an influencer. You don't have to be a big shot. You don't have to be, um, you don't have to be a celebrity. People can watch your life and hate it and, and feel like you are showing off or something like that. Just because we are Geza, Ube Muthi, people will hate you. That's the crazy part. Just because we are Geza, Ube Muthi, people will hate you so if you think no i mean i'm a nobody i can post my location sana i am begging you now don't do that you are somebody you are somebody and somebody out there is watching you is watching your life and they are thinking of stupid things like this saying that meaning i am watching their life and i am making my christian content based on their life insane 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 so I just wanted to share with you guys that people are actually crazy out here. People actually are insane. Like I think this is this this goes beyond me saying insane. It's psychotic. Because how are you watching somebody's video and thinking that that person is talking about you just because they they made reference to something that you are still doing? This is my salvation. That is the crazy part. You know what I'm saying? That is insane. You need to stop. I think this girl needs to seek help. To need, needs to seek help in order for her to, I don't know to, I don't know to what, but you need help, my love. You definitely need help. And I'm waiting, waiting, eagerly waiting for the day that you, Nani, you said you're gonna come, and um, you're gonna come and show me. You said something. You're gonna show me. You're gonna, you're gonna tell the world. You're gonna deal with me. I am eagerly waiting for that day. I am eagerly waiting for that day. And let me tell you now, Gesana, I am saved. I am not soft. I am definitely saved. I am not soft. You will not come here and think you will step over my head. We are not the same. I am not the one. I am not the one. Don't you ever think or dare go see you will disrespect me. And the crazy part is you're going to come with the ghost account. That's the thing that is boring me. Because why are you not coming with your chest? With your pseudo name? Don't you 
pseud with my pseudo name i think you know who you're talking to i don't know who the hell you are i don't even wish to know who the hell you are mara come for me call i will i will definitely answer because then come on oh sorry hits the other chick oh not me not me Oh, I will fight. Oh, book of life. So people, I think people just disrespect. I don't know. You thinking just because yeah, you saved, you can't even retaliate. Oh, I'm not the one. Not the two, not the three. I am not. Do not come for me. Do not call for me. Do not do that. I am not the one. So, Miss Luzuwe, wherever you are, darling, I'm almost certain you're going to be watching this since clearly you are a fan and not a darling. I'm waiting for you. I am surely waiting for I'm waiting for that day. Okay? Thanks. But anyway, that's the story time that I wanted to tell you guys. People are actually insane out here. We are about to do my hair. And also I need to tell you guys another thing. Okay, I'm gonna tell you when I'm doing my hair. Let me just lay it down and Quick. Yeah, make that part quick. I have been dying to do the Brazilian blowout Let me show you not the Brazilian blowout, but the what do they call it? So remember when I bought that thing from Sheen so that I can sleep with it I couldn't sleep with it. So I'm gonna try these curls because I'm just like This is the lady that does them That's how she does them Seeing that her hair is actually the same length as my hair, I was just like, I'm definitely going to do this. I don't know how it's going to turn out, but I'm definitely going to give it a try. Also, please do know that I do not have the rollers that she has. So I'm going to use bendy rollers to achieve the style. If it doesn't come out as we had initially wanted it to come out, it's also okay. But I'm going to try for it to be... Just a teeny weeny tiny perfect so i'm just going to open a section here on the crown of my head because this is the hair that falls um on your face mind you this wig is a this is a how many inches is this i forgot how many inches this was but it is a body weight wig that i have um so i decided to just it has layers already so I just decided, let me try with this wig. If whatever that we are trying to do does not come out, Sana, that's also fine. So what I'm going to do is, I think I want to put in some mousse so that it can have a little bit of hold. She puts holding spray, but I feel like I want to put holding spray tomorrow. Not a bit too much. I want to put holding spray tomorrow when I comb out the hair. So I'm just going to brush it out with some mousse. You can use whichever mousse that you want. This is a trial. We are going to see tomorrow. Now, Kona, it depends if I can sleep with this thing. If I wake up at Psugu and I can't sleep, you guys will then know it didn't work out. So I'm going to take this little piece and I'm going to take the biggest, the biggest, um, what are these things again? The biggest ones that I own. So I don't know if I must put one or double them up and put two like this so that this thing can be a bit bigger like this. Do you get me? So I don't know if this thing will hold, but I'm just going to try so that the curl can be big. So I'm going to take this part. Oh, it's falling apart already, Sana. Just try hold, my girl. Just try hold, okay? Because I don't have, I already ordered them on Shein. You guys know I'm very quick with it. So I'm going to take this big piece. I already put some mousse on it. And then I'm going to comb it out. We're doing this together. If it fails, then sharp. If it doesn't fail, then we thank God. So you're going to start from the top. Roll your hair. Come down. And then you're gonna put it in a bun like that is it staying it's staying 
<laughs> we're gonna put it in the bud like that it's not perfect but i mean it's something it's close to it and then i'm deciding that i'm gonna go um section by section because i want the curls to super super lost i have been feeling the 90s hairstyle because the hair um came out so well on my previous video so i was just like you guys remember that short wig that i had that i cut the bravery that i had to do that wig so why not do all of it so i'm gonna what, are, what is this i'm gonna section these into two and because of the back um of the curl can somewhat be kind of because the hair is long first of all and the back of the hair i want the curl to be tight so i'm gonna use one um one thingy one one bendy roller just like that so just comb that out the big blue ones by the way and then i'm gonna roll because every single strand she rolled it going up so i'm gonna roll that going up this is an overnight blowout summer so it better be blown out by tomorrow put that ah! One thing about it, I'm not scared to take risks when it comes to him. Why is it not staying? Because I don't want it like that. I want it to be... Let me take another one. Let me take an orange one. Okay, comb that out. We're going to put the hair oil tomorrow. So I'm just going to speed through this video so that I don't bore you guys. I look like I'm the man Yeah, but I was down and out like last week Tell me where have you been? Came out of nothing, girl Don't act like I'm your man I did one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And I just realized that this is just bendy rollers overnight. I mean, black people have been doing this since ages, and it looks so cute. I look cute like this. <laughs> black people have been doing this. White people just came and called it overnight, what, what, blowout. And then they ran with it, obviously, because when you go to TikTok, it's only them who are doing this thing. But anyway, it is what it is. Um, <clears throat> I think I want to redo this one again. Is it already giving? <laughs> Sana, tomorrow is going to be a very big day because if this thing is not giving, I am going to, to scream and cry because I have an event tomorrow. And, you know, okay, I finally managed. Sana. I hope this thing comes out right because I made sure that I don't do anything here so that I can sleep. I sleep with my stomach and sometimes my back. So I made sure that it's empty here so that I can be able to raise my head because I don't know how I'm going to sleep with this thing. Okay. I, I look like some Chinese. <laughs> well, that's Indian. But anyway, yeah, this is how they look like. I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven with this one on top. Because this one is how the hair is going to fall. Let's just hope it falls the way I want it to fall. But anyway, I um, also wanted to speak to you guys. First of all, I wanted to apologize. I want to apologize to all the non-Christian followers on my page. If you are new here, I gave my life to Christ last year, May. Um, everybody always asks why and how I'm gonna do a separate video of my journey thus far but I created my life to Christ last year 2023 May and it's been an amazing and absolutely incredible journey um, please do not leave because I'm, I'm about to say something um, I'd like to apologize to all my nine Christian followers I think I shoved down the Christian content down your neck and not just your neck, but I feel like on everybody's necks. Because that was my new reality. Or that is my new reality. Forgetting that not everybody's Christian. 
not everybody follows religion not everybody's religious people believe in higher beings people believe in the universe you know what i'm saying and it's unfair now that i come and i say christians this christians that you have i'm christian that is the content that you're going to get from me when these people have been riding with me since day one you know i think it had to take sitting down because i was set down <laughs> i was set down by those close to me and those who care about me to be like babe we understand you've given your life to christ we understand one two three four five i'm not going to suppress my salvation in order for somebody to come and like me or like my content but it's unfair like i said to the people that have been riding with you since day one for you to now come and say if you don't like my content then just unsubscribe the subscriptions haven't gone down funny enough but the watch hours have of which i understand and like i said still i'm not going to suppress my um salvation but i think i was not being fair and i was also a bit rude to the people that have been following me like i've been saying because you what if a muslim person is watching me and i mean every day i'm this christianity this christianity that and obviously they believe in allah so i think i need to step back and regroup and see what type of content i want to put out obviously having the god element i think when it comes to vlogs i will not put in that much of christianity because almost everybody watch my vlogs but then i'll have separate videos where i talk about christianity and my salvation and everything like that you know what i'm saying like christian girl talk if you want to watch the christian girl talk you can if you don't want to watch the christian girl talk you don't have to but then when it comes to a vlog now you won't be able to enjoy a vlog because when you believe in my lord you don't believe in god and now somebody that you loved so much you can't watch them anymore because they are god this god that it's still going to be god this god that but it's going to be separate from my vlogs but now i'm at the point where i want to to step away from vlogs a bit step away from just youtube as a whole and regroup recoup also and just see how i want to structure my content now you know what i'm saying so i think maybe for the next few months i'll be away a bit I don't, first of all i didn't want to say anything you know I just wanted to just disappear but i feel like i owe it to the darlings for me to not just get up and disappear but to speak and talk to you guys about this so that whenever i upload a picture on instagram because the short form content is still going to be there trust me i'm still going to get to do get videos me for church and 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 and, and. but with youtube i think i need a break i honestly need a break and yeah i think yeah i need a break I need a break i need to regroup i need to i think i need to focus actually on my salvation because i think i i was yes doing it for the right reasons but god said to me it's as if you are love bombing me and also you want people to know that you have been saved so much and you want it to be a thing of look at me god i'm telling you people it, that's that, it was love bombing god i actually was love bombing god it was a thing of you know when you first start out your salvation journey you want to do everything so perfectly you want to please god so much that i think that's what i did i then took everything that i had and i focused it on youtube and i focused my, my my salvation on youtube to be like to god okay i'm telling your children about you i'm telling your children about you give me five points give me five points give me five brownie points it's not like that i was actually love bombing god you know when you want people when you want when your man your narcissistic man wants people to see what he does for you not that i'm a narcissist but that was the perfect example when your man wants to people to see what they do for you and obviously they praise him yes it's a good thing to praise god yes i've saved so many people with my salvation but i think i wasn't doing it for the right reason i think i wanted god to see me that i'm actually doing something whereas my salvation is me and mine and god's alone it's just the two of us you know so that's why i said i need to recoup i'm still a baby in christ i feel like everything that i do is okay yes but also it's not okay i had to i had to realize that you know what you need to be sure that you're doing this for the right reasons like i said i've won so many people's lives so many people have come and tell me listen since you've started sharing your christian journey one two three that's why i won't stop but then i've realized that what am i doing it for 
you know, I've, I've come to understand and God has come to help me understand. You need to do it for you. You need to do it with a cheerful heart. Yes, I was doing it with a cheerful heart, but also that thing that, did you see me? Did, did you see me? Are you seeing me? Do you see me do it? You know what I'm saying? So that's why I'm saying I want to step away from YouTube and just focus on that, focus on my salvation, focus on my relationship with God, focus on just the things outside of YouTube and then come back not a different person, but come back knowing what to say, when to say it, how to say it, how to address this. You know what I'm saying? So, salvation is just, oh, Christianity is just a learning curve consistently and constantly. So, I'm constantly learning and I am here to admit if I'm wrong, I'm definitely wrong. And I am sorry to everybody that I was wrong, that I have wronged, sorry, that I have wronged and i'm sorry to the people that i was saying yeah now nah, if you don't want to watch my channel then go which is wrong those people have been watching you since day one they've been guys if it's not for you i don't have to do youtube you know i don't have to earn money on youtube because you watch the ads you want you don't skip the five minutes ad you it's you it's all about you at the end of the day i have to please you my subscribers but also i'm pleasing you with something that i love I please you I love it you get what I'm saying so and I'm eternally grateful to go oh sorry I'm taking it to God again um how do I say this without <laughs> so I'm, I'm I'm grateful to God again for giving me this platform to talk to you to his children and share the message and share the salvation but I need to go about it the right way the right channels and not do it yes to please God yes but not to love bomb God. And I don't want God to, okay, only today she spoke about me, tick. Only she spoke about me in another video, tick. Only she spoke about me in another video, tick. No. So you definitely will not be getting a baddie crawly. That crawly is dead. Miss XO is finished. Book gone, dead. But you will get me, but me that you loved. Me with the vlogs, me going out to try lunches and dinners and that, that. You will just be getting the vlogs that you used to get. But I am changing. Yes, there will be some parts of Christianity in my vlogs. But I'm changing everything completely to separate the Christianity talk, Christian girls talk, whatever. Have its own separate views apart from the vlogs. So I will be taking a break. And I hope I come back. Um strong no, not strong because nothing happened but i hope i come back um being able to serve that our content the content that i always used to serve my subscribers the content that made you guys fall in love with me obviously i made you guys fall in love with me in story times and then i stopped but i'm not going to do story times ever again unless it's such a thing but uh yeah that is what i wanted to share with you guys and once again i'm so sorry to my subscribers and the people that have been watching me and riding with me um i think at that present moment like i said it was a bit selfish for me so i'm learning and i'm correcting my mistakes and i hope that you guys will forgive me and when i come back it's going to be better it's going to be better than it was better than it is and you guys are going to enjoy my content all over again so yeah thank you my darlings i will see you guys tomorrow we're going to an event tomorrow a crocs event so yeah you guys remember i went to the last one the previous one so there's another one and we are going there so i'm gonna go sleep do i put holding spray i think i'm gonna put holding spray so i'm gonna go sleep with these on i hope hope and pray that tomorrow morning they come out looking proper oh i'm using the trust me holding spray you guys remember we're also going to a trust me event very soon so yeah darling i will see you tomorrow um yeah. morning loves good morning it's the next day and i'm about to get ready for the event let me tell you i didn't sleep properly <laughs> i did not have a great oh this thing held on to my no Ugh, i have to make it i didn't have the best sleep because this girl was on my head but um yo i have to stick this down again i don't want to lie to you i didn't have the best sleep so yo this thing is stuck to the 
The glue. Oh my word. No. Why? I have to lay this thing down again. But um Angala Gashe. I had to wake up and take a grandpa because I, I had a headache from not getting well rested. But that's okay. Guys, I think I made a mistake by shaving my face because the hair is back and it is a lot. Like the hair is back and it is a lot and I don't know what to do with myself now because I'm just like, damn. <laughs> I had to shave my chin and my eyebrows yesterday a little bit here because it just finished it. But um, yeah, I'm gonna do my makeup now. You guys know my makeup drill, but some of you love when I do my makeup. It's therapeutic to you. So um, I'm gonna do that, just speed up. Also, uh, a few of my darlings asked me to do a detailed makeup video showing you the brushes that I used. I didn't know that you guys would be interested in brushes, but I don't wanna lie to you. I've been getting a lot of um, questions on what brushes that I use. Especially when you guys saw the brushes when I was washing them. I think I used like five, if not six brushes in total when I do my makeup. Because I'm just, I'm sorry guys, construction, you know this. So I'm going to do that video later on. Because you guys know I'm taking a break from the vlogs. So yeah, I'm going to do a video later on to just show you guys. But for now, let's just beat it up and do my face. Please look at that hairiness. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Look at that. Are you guys seeing that? Look at that. And the hair's back. Look, do you see that? It's back here. It said, we want to show you. And to think that I've stopped using this thing. The hair grew back. And I'm getting darker here. Let me show you. Do you see it? I'm getting darker here. Because I shaved it and it's coming back. But the hair's back. No. It's back. <laughs> Imagine. Sana, if you are a man and you watch my channel and you want to grow yourself a beard, go and buy Minoxidil. Like, I don't know how long I've been singing this song. Like, you guys can see me. I had stopped. It's been... Oh, maybe... Because I thought... Okay, the, um, the one from that other place gave me a headache, so I stopped it. The one with the blue bottle. So now I use this one from, from Shein. So maybe... This one is the one also that's giving me a freaking... Because I stopped that one, but the hair's still coming back. Maybe it's this one. I, I'm just going to stop everything completely, you know, because I have hair everywhere. And now that it's winter and I'm super, super lighter, you can evidently see it. So I think I'm going to stop this one as well because my makeup is not... <laughs> but this is so cute. I find it so cute. Like, I find it so cute. Like, I just think it's cute. It's like a newborn baby when they have hair all over their face. I just find it so cute. But anyway, let us do our face. Oh, I didn't do my brows. Let's do my brows. Oh, I didn't wipe them. I like a wiped brow before. Because I want that thing to sit properly.
girls have been making noise about this i had to give it a try this is the maybelline fit me matte and poreless normal to oily uh powder this is the warm nude i didn't know which color would suit me but i think the warm nude um makes perfect sense i have seen tiktok i have seen instagram the girls have been going on and on and on so i was like i need to try this for myself and i think i'm obsessed i love it but we'll see as the day goes by how it's whole, how it holds the face intact and stuff i don't know if i should go in with my huda beauty because that's the one that i used to bake but i think she will do so i'll just use this one i won't bake i'll just use this girl and then we'll see how she does because like i said i watch tamara renee a lot and she's been going on about this so but in america they have a different one to the ones that we use so i don't know but yeah i'm almost done with my face guys you can see the hair <laughs> you can see the hair i shaved my face last week like that is hair it's not a crack it's not my makeup cracking it's hair it's literal hair yeah. I need I need to shave my face again or do I need to get it done professionally? Because I shaved it last week. I shaved it last week with you guys. You saw me. But it's coming back now. No, I think I'm gonna stop Minoxi in general. But the funny thing is I love my face like this. <laughs> I love my face like this. I just think it looks cute. It looks like a baby. Like I feel like a baby. You know when a baby comes out, they're so hairy. So I just feel like it looks like a baby. I like it. I like it. Honestly speaking, I like the hairiness. Like, I just think it's cute for me personally. So <laughs> I might not um, dermaplan my face. I might just leave it like this, you know? Because I think it's cute. I honestly think it's cute. Uh, I can't, I'm so excited for my hair. I don't because they said on the invites they said brunch, right? So I'm like if it's a brunch Do we wear heels or do we wear our crocs guys? I don't want to lie to you. I hate winter fashion I can't stand it. The layers make me sick. I just don't like winter fashion at all. So I'm just like What am I gonna wear time for some blush? You know me, I will put blush. So I'm just like, what am I going to wear? I already know that I want to wear my white jacket. Um, I haven't worn that jacket in a while. I got that jacket from Zara. It's a, it's not a jacket, sorry. It's a blazer, right? So I'm just like, okay, I want to wear that. But also, yo, I put too much to the side. I need to dilute it with the orange one. But blush, Sana, I will put blush. I'm obsessed with blush. Yo, this hair is too much. This hair is a lot on my face. Time for Yadli. Now, I don't really line my lips because I feel like you should only line your lips if you have uh, if you use um, lipstick so because I don't use lipstick I only use gloss but I line them anyway because I don't feel like a girl <laughs> I'm using lip oil from you guys know this I'm using this lip oil so I'm done with my face time for the hair 
like I told you guys, I didn't sleep properly because of this hair. But let's see how it looks like. If it doesn't come out the way that I had anticipated, huge possibility I'm going to cry. But I need to lay it down again because it lifted. Let me take out the thingies. what I wanted. I need that comb. Let me lay this thing down first. We're gonna fix it together. Don't worry. Okay, um... <laughs> uh, okay, let's try push them back. Oh, It's it's definitely giving blowout, but I think these things are too high up. I might have to, like comb them properly see push that back i might have to hot comb them sorry you know because it's giving blowout it truly is giving blow but a bit too much blowout like it's giving hmm it is giving blowout this is actually stunning but i look like a 90s babe for real like <laughs> i look like a 90s bait for real. So I'm just gonna hot comb it now and see how it come, comes out. I don't want to destroy the curls as much, so I'm not gonna comb it out. Just gonna use this comb just to, you know, and then put some holding spray. It's definitely giving 90s babe because, you know, but I don't want it to give too much 90s babe. So just gonna hot comb it a bit and then see how it looks like. Yeah, see, it's going to work. Don't worry. Don't worry. <laughs> Let me hot comments. Yo, it's giving what's love. Definitely giving what's love. Let me take this off. So the event starts at 12. I'm going to get there at half past because you guys know I'm always on time. And mm -mm. I know it's not going to start exactly at Okay, let's try hot comment. Oh, this is stunning. Okay, let me put some spray first. This is stunning. This is stunning. Okay, let's hot comb. I don't want it to have a parting necessarily, so that's why I didn't uh, put a parting. So, yeah. I just wanted it to be free pot. I'm just gonna lay it down here a bit because it's a bit high. <laughs> Sorry. Love it love it just just the way i wanted it this is exactly what i wanted so i'm gonna put some spray to hold the hair so that the curl doesn't fall easily but with um with this type of uh what's this when you put bendy rollers bendy rollers last a long time so you don't have to necessarily put too much spray but because i want it to hold i'm gonna put spray this is exactly how i wanted the hair let me just because there's a Stunning. Stunning. Okay, bring it to the front of it. 
absolutely stunning 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 this is what i wanted this the curtain bangs it's giving 90s sana this is exactly what i wanted this is exactly what i wanted oh my word oh my goodness stunning absolutely stunning let me just put these back a bit come them out there we go there we go stunning needs him in the 90s what what it's giving her it's definitely giving her can i put this on the side like this gorgeous i'm gorgeous i gorgeous you stunning gorgeous let me just so that it stays in place and it doesn't move okay that's all gorgeous sana at this point i am a god when it comes to it. okay let's go get dressed but this is our hair it came out stunning let's see the back do you see the curl you guys are gonna see it when i wear the blazer because the blazer is white so you're gonna see how the hair looks like but this is stunning absolutely beautiful i'm obsessed this is the but this is a body wave wig um i think how many inches is this uh how many inches is this don't know how many inches is, but this is the body wave wig bendy rollers brazilian blowout brazilian blowout stunning let's go get dressed oh my love i'm obsessed hold on getting dressed guys i absolutely hate winter fashion or winter in general because i never know what to wear also with this brunch um firstly it's at a restaurant right and i'm not sure if the restaurant but it said brunch on the invite so i'm assuming we're going to be sitting down and eating because the last one it was so fun there was games there was this there was that so i'm just going to carry my crocs just in case we actually do play games there and stuff but the invitation said brunch so i'm assuming it's going to be brunch also winter fashion is just a mix because i don't know what to wear but anyway trip check record me <laughs> um okay i'm wearing this blazer that i got from zara i think it was four years ago um they also had it in black so i chose white and then i'm wearing this top that i got from mr prize i'm wearing these jeans that i got from levi's and then i'm wearing um these boots that i got from Shein. but my only problem is right i don't know if the boots should be inside the pants like this okay let me put this camera down guys this is why you need to be with me in real this is why you need to move in with me so you can help me get dressed so i don't know if the boots should be inside or put them like put the jeans like that all right or should they be like this because this is the bag that i'm carrying it goes with my it goes with my top right and obviously the silver with the white and the silver so i'm just like i'm so conflicted as to how i must wear this like like must i put this inside let me put the jeans inside like this but i hate winter i don't want to lie to you i hate layers of clothing absolutely hate it like i can't stand it so I don't know man because but anyway you guys are gonna see this outfit and be like okay this is what she chose but yeah so this is how it looks like this is how everything looks like i think it's i think outside makes sense yeah outside makes sense and or must i wear the cream jacket from sheen the short the shorter one 
Well, that wouldn't be nice. But that one is cream. It's not white. I want to wear this white one. Because if it's brunch, or must I wear formal pants and not jeans? So now I don't know. I really don't know. But white, white, what are these? White boots are just so complicated to style, you know? But anyway, I'm going to wear this Lissables Roses perfume. And for earrings, I'm wearing these Dior earrings so that is how we look like and yeah we're gonna get going now it's half past 11 uh this thing starts at 12 but like i said i'm gonna get there at 12 so yeah i'll see you guys when we get there i don't know who's gonna be there the table was supposed to come but she just called me now she is sick so i think i'm just gonna go alone but i know influence is gonna be there so i'm gonna see whatever so yeah i went and changed changed well not my whole outfit but let me show you so, I decided to wear a white, uh, um, cozy little t-shirt, and then I'm wearing these silver pumps that I got from Shein. This top is from Shein, jeans are from Levi's, blazers from H&M Zara, sorry. And, uh, this bag, I feel like this makes more sense, right? I, I was not feeling that outfit. I think the top is the one that threw me off. And then, I'm gonna wear these girls. I'm wearing them because... I'm not filming when I come back, so I have to see it through, Sana, that I do not take them off. Because, you know, once you take shades off, it's going to give you something not nice. So, yeah, I nearly fell. So, this is how we look like. And then I'm going to carry my shoes. I feel like it goes. Like, the white and the pink goes. in Because, what if they say, go wear your pumps? No, I don't have, you know what I'm saying? So, this goes. And... Yeah, that is what we look like. I look stunning. I look absolutely stunning. Okay, okay, let's go, guys. Before we are late, but we are very early. This is why I'm always early, so that if instances like this happen, I can change in time. So, okay, let's go. Listen, I know, I know circular music is something that I'm trying to stop, but 10 fingers. Mega God will have to this song. This song, the fact that the song just makes me be like, they killed Mega? Sana, they killed Mega. They killed Mega. We just arrived. There's no parking and the security guard just gave me parking. Guys, having a driving a big car, people I don't know what it is. Like people respect you if I can say that. But yeah, we just got here and we're about to go inside um guys my phone is going off i gotta like people are tagging me on the thing on tiktok apparently we got saved <laughs> because we're looking for husbands that time <laughs> <laughs> yeah! internet is such a funny place and i love it here i love it so much this outfit is so chilled. I don't know if I must wear this blazer. Or, because it's not that cold. Or is it cold? I don't know. Okay, but let's go, guys. Um, I'll see you inside. If it's cold, if it's not cold, I'll just put the blazer on top of my, you know. But let's go. Oh my God! <laughs> I need those.
Miss X. Oh, thank you so much, Mom. Are you guys ready for these questions? Okay. So, by the way, up for grabs is a voucher for 5,000 rands. Please don't forget to tag Crocs ZA and use the hashtag come as you are. Thank you. What is what? The official handle for the company we were at. Crocs and the Who was first? Who was first? I'm so <laughs> Crocs and the In any guys, we've been eating. And <laughs> show A few things juice bread what 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 so let's go park my door thanks so honestly no food here just this You have to see through. It's not bad though. But these clothes fell so wow. Okay. But it's still light. It's not as prominent. They're not as prominent as they were in the morning. Let me see if we push them back. Yeah, they still they still they still light. It's still light, they can get away with it. But I think really it's just something that you have to do every night. Hence the TikTok girlies are doing it every night. But um Okay, we are back home. Event oh. Crocs knows Crocs know how to pull off an event. That was exceptional. 
amazing beautiful give me 14 of those okay give me 14 i need something for my lips give me 14 of those thanks very much but um event too good uh there was a lot of tiktokers there guys i think you get you can differentiate between tiktok and insta and youtubers let me tell you we even have this we had this conversation with zz and um what's this bully well like do you know that you can tell the difference between tiktokers and youtubers i don't know why tiktok is, it's like the fans not fat what not fancy sorry the the funky kids they wear all of these funky clothes you can just tell that these are young kids and these are older ones the youtube side okay but anyway, I met a lot of your faves. I met Grace. I met this beautiful lady. She didn't tell me her name. She made me these. So um, we we had every table had jewelry things where you can make jewelry from. And then she made me she made me this. She made me this Miss EXO thing. It's so cute. Well, it's Miss EXO. I'm not Miss EXO anymore. But the thought, love it. I'm home. I'm about to show you guys this, but before I show you, I need to give you a little reminder. But our, about our faves, Pocket Burger. I know it. Ha I have to remind you guys because every other day I'm getting questions about how am I going to do this, this, and this, and that. I'm not familiar with it, but I love how a lot of the subscribers actually went. Guys, you know some things that you can just see that this is an ad. It's very addy, but if you have built a community where people actually trust you, they trust your judgment and they trust you. I myself go and pocket broker. I may not make a thousand, whatever, whatever, but it's just something that you can sit at home and do and it's gonna make you money. You know what I'm saying? But also you don't have to leave your nine to five. If you are nine to five, you can do it as a, as a side hustle. You get what I'm saying? So just a little reminder, I will let you in on a secret strategy that I use. Basically, the basis of the basis of trading is risk management right and if you stick to it you will significantly improve your financial situation i'm gonna show you how now as i obviously i will log on to my account and do it on my phone and i'll just put it on the screen here so you guys can see how i do it and how also you can do it as well very simple straight to the point also like i said somebody even asked me do i do they have to have ios you can just go to ww pocket broker but i always say that use my link so it takes you directly to the app my link is always in the description box when you use my link it takes you directly to the site and then when you get there it'll look somewhat like this like i said i'm going to be doing it on my phone and you are going to be following it from the screen right so what you do is you go onto my link right now i'm using a video that i used um that i mentioned pocket broker before so you click on the link i'm gonna use safari it's gonna open up like this right now it's gonna give you this page this is the home page and then email i'm gonna put i use 26 um done and then password this is not my password i have my password saved and then for a promo code you're gonna say xo right xo 100 and then i have read and accepted the following agreement public offer agreement sign up because i'm trying to show you guys how to do this this is my demo account right now i have from my guys it's you see there it's fifty thousand um and 61 rand with 20 cents that is a demo it is not my official account right so by logging on and choosing this demo account this will teach you how to do trading properly you can also like i said always go to expert traders and see how they do their thing so that you can copy from them and do the same thing that you did whilst using their um what's this their expertise somewhere by using their account and their demo you saw that sim how simple that was literally just signing up like i said i have an account already but i just wanted to do the sign up process so that you can see how easy it is especially if you enter my code so it's really simple three clicks away from literally having an income without worrying much just go to my link put in your code so you can get a hundred percent of your first deposit hundred percent of your first deposit the code is miss xo 100 follow the link from any video that i've talked about pocket broker or whenever i upload a story on instagram you can just click it and it'll give you the direct link to go and check this out but enough about that um time for me to show you guys what i've got from the event but first 
at first let me show you something so i was on instagram right so i follow lisa lisa madibe i follow lisa madibe so lisa posted posted this picture of herself right lisa posted this picture of herself and then i was like these shades these shades but you guys know me i'm not a fan of black um shades but when i saw these i said these would make perfect sense with remember the hair that i did the updo and the you know i said these would make sense and then when i went to, sorry so when you go like that please are you are you kidding me are you kidding me i said i have to get them so i was like i don't know what this label is and i was like i'm scared to ask her because what if she doesn't reply only for me to be like you know what i'm going to look for that label but when i saw it i'm like hmm this looks like coach this definitely looks like coach so i went and i said www.coach and i searched for coach sunglasses i could have easily worn sunglasses the those black ones that i have obviously the ones that you saw when i tried on um those earrings but i don't know why i wanted to line up here but also i just think i i loved these ones that i saw on lisa because they were absolutely stunning i wouldn't have necessarily bought a new pair of black shades i'm not a fan of black shades you guys know this but when i saw those ones i said i don't care a damn i have to have them so i went on line got myself these glasses they come in um what's this i bought them on the coach site you can buy them as well i didn't pay any customs these were two. how much were they i'll tell you now guys if there's one thing i'm willing to spend on is shades and i don't care them how much they are they were 2386 so 2400 when you round it off so this is how they look like this is how they come in coach outside stunning stunning so inside is the coach thingy this is to clean the glasses obviously you guys know this but hey this is to clean the glasses and then this is the little bag or whatever that you want to call it and then wow wow yo these are stunning oh that coach sign also this side is the coach this side it's looking that way this side it's looking this way i don't know why but yo guys these shades are stunning stunning i had to get them you're a liar you are a liar oh what a beautiful pair of shades I can imagine myself on vacation saying go give with my curly hair and my beautiful dress with my hair up in a bun like this with beautiful earrings do you get do you get the vision oh yo i couldn't feel my earrings i thought they fell oh christian doa you're out of your mind do you get it do you get the vision do you stunning stunning i am not a fan of black shades you guys know this but when i saw these i said lisa you have shown me the light you have this is the first and last pair that i'll that i'll buy with a black lens black everything but this is stunning i always thought i wanted the celine uh triumph one but when i saw these i said hmm because nine thousand on black shades knowing very well that i'm not gonna wear them that often no i think also with these ones i have to kind of sort of wear them a lot so that i can really really like them because i don't like black shades for the 50th time but these absolutely stunning gorgeous i'll take 14 of those i'll take 14 because of how gorgeous they are i'll definitely take 14 gorgeous stunning oh i'm obsessed i am obsessed this would have ate if i tried them on in the morning and the hair was still oh this would have eaten you know but this is stunning lisa lisa madibe i love you i love you for showing me the lights with these shades but yeah this is coach you can get them on the coach website i will leave the link for you guys gorgeous gorgeous 
gorgeous coach is coming back fire sana guns blazing i don't know why this thing doesn't have a thing um doesn't have a case well this is the case yes but i need like the case way yeah but these are my shades these are my new shades i love them oh much i am obsessed i am obsessed i think i'm gonna do a reel tomorrow yes yes indeed i i very much am going to do a reel tomorrow but you guys well you wouldn't see them first because i'm gonna upload the reel <laughs> so let me put this back so that when i do the reel they see everything that came with the shades um now for the shoes guys you know what the funny story is i had chosen a different um a different shoe to the one that i just to the ones that i got now until i saw zizi's shoes but zizi's shoes look so much cuter because she has a small foot i'm sure she's a size four I mean i'm a size 41 which is a size eight so i'm going to get the most comfortable shoes in the history of all shoes and the fact that we're gonna put lama giblets in my giblets giblets gible yeah we know. love it love it love it love it i've got so many giblets or whatever i feel like this is gonna be perfect for traveling for whatever whatever and then i want to show you guys how cool and how cute my giblets what are they called sana let me do so visa can't kill me and they gave us socks so pretty that's actually so pretty like they give what is that one of the gibbets so i got so many gibbets and i have a lot of gibbets as well give oh, it you uh, please you can't um, i have a lot of gibbets from last year as well because remember i went to that other coach um thing how cute is this like i took so many gold stuff this butterfly stunning natatabo hello kitty oh and then i took this i don't know what this is i think you put them and then i just took a lot of gold stuff because i saw them like i said i saw them on zizi's shoe and i said come here look at how cute this gold heart is oh my gosh and then this one it's like a pearl situation whatever and then this one Guys, apparently these things are expensive. So when I saw the opportunity to take them, I said I'm gonna take them. Here's another gold one. So cute. The, I took two of these because I wanted the shoes to match. Obviously, I took mostly two of everything because I wanted the shoes to match. This cute little star. My shoes are gonna be gold. Like gold, gold, gold. Wait, let me put them on. I'll show you now when I'm done. Dollar. Dollar. Metro, your metro. I feel it all with a lesbian. Can I knock on your door, baby? Let me in. I said, I'll lie. The way it's shining, everything is just gold. Ung Afunga was saying, Nim Muruti Gucci. But this is how they look like. <laughs> I just feel like the black and the gold make sense rather than me putting like different ones. So let me put this heart, one more heart. Oh, it's a bit too much, no? Yeah, it's enough like this. It's enough like this. Oh, so cute. If I did not see them on ZZ, I think I would have got... The ones that I took, they're not nice. Like, I promise you, they're not nice. They look like those shoes that are Kanye wears, like my naps. You know, my naps. I don't like those. But these are so cute. And they're so comfortable, guys. Crocs are so comfortable. This is my second pair of Crocs ever. Obsessed with them. But, yeah... I hope you guys enjoy this vlog. I hope you guys loved this vlog. I will see you on my next one. Please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And once again, as I had mentioned, that we are taking a break. I don't know how long this break is going to be. I honestly don't want to lie to you, but I need time out. I need to be by myself. I need to focus on what type of content I want to put out again. Um, like I said, I'm going to if not differentiate i'm just going to just take the two apart i'm going to have strictly christian girl content on one side and focused on the vlog on the side but if anything happens in the vlog 
that has me talking about god then i am so sorry but i'll definitely try and be more um aware of that not everybody is a christian and not everybody that follows me is a christian you know what i'm saying so yeah thank you for bearing with me i love you guys so much i will see you on my next vloggy darlings which is going to be on a saturday and that is the last one i think because saturday's one is a brutal fruit vlog we are doing something so fun for 24 hours i'm so so excited you guys are going to see it on the vlog but yeah i'll see you guys soon oh guys one more thing nobody has claimed the jewelry box again mind you this is the second time i am announcing the winner and nobody's claiming it so i'm gonna do this for the last time um what uh, what am i gonna do if okay what's the question when is my birthday Sharp. i'm going to do this for the last time if nobody is claiming that box i'm going to throw it away because i don't need that jewelry it's been sitting here and i really want to give it away to somebody deserving so just answer also i pick people who have been commenting on my channel because whenever somebody comments you see you see which video they comment on how many times they've commented and stuff like that so if you've never commented and then you're commenting just this once because i'm giving away something i'm not gonna give it to you you're not gonna win but if i see that it's somebody that's been active and they've been commenting for a very long time then yeah also the brutal fruit competition winners i already picked them i will announce them on the vlog that is going to come out on saturday so yes darlings i hope i'm not forgetting anything but i love you guys so much i will see you soon it's weird for me to say please don't forget to like comment and subscribe because i'm not going to be posting that much but if you love me that much you can still like comment and subscribe <laughs> i love you guys bye trees. Oh.